You run a gender inclusive monastery. Can you share why you decided to opt for this and what the challenges and benefits are of this model? Okay, so it's a gender equal monastery. There were several reasons for it. One is that in my uh, monastic journey, there have been times when I have been excluded from uh, different Dharma activities or uh, all op different opportunities because of being a woman. And so uh, I have male students. I didn't want to exclude them uh, from the Abbey and from becoming monastics here. So out of, you know, a feeling of not wanting to harm others, but also of uh, an intention not to create more uh, exclusion karma again, because it's very painful to be excluded from uh, Dharma activities when you really have that aspir uh, aspiration to learn. Um, also, another reason is because I think for Buddhism to spread in the West, uh, we have to have gender equality. Uh, I hear that not only from the women, but also from the men that, uh, you know, the absence of gender equality in traditional Buddhism sometimes turns people away from the, the beauty of the Buddhist teachings, which is really, uh, in my eyes, a very sorrowful event when that happens.